Infrared heating panel, Sun Life One. This panel comes in different sizes, depends on the size of the room. Um, it's slim. It's uh, a little bracket sits to the wall or the ceiling and the heater slots in. There's a slight shadow gap at the back of the heater. Um, and then you have the controller, which uh, is called our IR Sun regulator that will regulate energy flow. That improves efficiency uh, because it's clicking in and click out more regularly. Therefore, the panel is not cooling as much. Um, what we're asked a lot is about how it integrates with solar, solar PV in your roof. We have a lot of inquiries from clients that are putting solar on the roof and they're using to for electricity within their home. So they have three options there. You have a heat pump, you have a convector wall heater, or you have an infrared panel. Um, why would you choose the IR panel? There's different types on the market. This one is our premium panel with a 15 year guarantee. It's a low wattage heater. So if, if you were comparing to the convector electric wall heater, you would be using more energy. So for example, this is a 750 watt panel. Um, with This is only my, with, with my personal opinion, with what I've seen comparing to the convector wall heaters that we would be using approximately 24, 25% less energy uh, wattage. So example being a house that required 10 kilowatts of heating with IR, would require 13, 14 kilowatts on average of heating with convector heaters. Okay, um, so that's a big advantage because you could get to the point where you need to upgrade your supply, whereas by going with infrared, you may not need that. Um, a heat pump uses electricity as well, um, but that is always on. So with an IR panel, you're producing power off the roof and you're using that to power your home contribute to power your home we're not saying it's going to run all the radiators but what it will do is it makes sense to use electricity that you're producing to use it to use that electric to heat your home so what happens is you're producing power um, you're overproducing, and then they have the system to heat your hot water and then you have the system to divert it into an ir panel within the home so that could be a home office it could be the main living area you have a number of different options there but if you're spending, for example, 300 euros a month in electric and you put solar panels in, you reduce that by, for example, 50 euros a month. That is contributing towards the electric running of the house and also the IR panels. Um, so that is, that is the way uh, things are developing. Why would you use infrared? Because it's easy to install, easy to retrofit. You don't need to upgrade your windows, don't need to upgrade insulation within your home. You can simply install an infrared panel within a room, rooms, whatever you want to do. You can do out the full house, you can do out partially the house, you can phase it, you don't have to do it all together. Comes with a 15 year warranty, up to a 35, 40 year lifespan, and then it's 90% recyclable. So once it becomes end of life for your own, you know, for, for your own peace of mind, or not even peace of mind, for, for for um, it, it's it's good to know that uh, it's fully well ninety percent recyclable, and once it becomes end of life, it can be opened up and repaired and put back up again. It can also be painted as well, um, and this controller is you download the app and you can use the phone to turn on and off the heating, set up a timer. Um, so if you're using a home office and you're away and you want to come back, you can turn on the heating. So fully fully. Um, flexible there and how you, you use the heating. So finally, I'll finish with infrared. It's a nice, gentle, comfortable heat. Um, doesn't dry the air, doesn't carry dust, doesn't burn the oxygen. So it's more like a, a sun heat, natural heat within the room. This has benefits for the human body. You can see it on our website under health benefits. Um, and it is, it's benefits for the, the well-being of you and the building because you're putting heat into the fabric of the building. Rather than the convector heater, you're heating the envelope, the internal volume of the room. The door is open, the heat's gone. If that comes onto any colder surfaces, you get condensation, you get damp. With this type of heat, it's radiating across the room, hitting off surfaces. Those surfaces absorb the heat, therefore improving the, 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 the building as well as, as, as you. So for more information, do check out our website, infraredheat.ie.